Hi, Adam from Audio Imperia. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the account area of our new Audio Imperia website. Here, you'll be able to access your account information. So let's have a look at some of the most important features. So when you click on the account button, you'll be greeted by the login page where you'll input your login details like I'm doing here. For security reasons, to access your account for the first time, you'll need to reset the password of your Audio Imperia account. This can be done here. Once inside, you'll be greeted by the dashboard where there's a range of options for you to choose from. If you had an account on our previous site, all that information will have been ported over to our new website. So your details and account information should be present and located inside of the account details section found here. Here, you'll be able to see the email your account is linked to, as well as change your password and update your details should you need to. In the orders tab, you'll be able to see any past or future orders you've made with us. Any orders made using our previous website will be shown here in the order history. You'll also be able to see any orders that are pending payment. For example, if you're eligible for an EDU discount on one of our products, once approved, you'll see the order pending in this tab, along with the option to make the payment when you're ready. You'll also be able to access invoices on this page if required. Accessing the My Libraries tab will bring up a list of products you've purchased with us on the new site. Now, it's important to mention here that products bought on our old site won't show up in the My Libraries tab. Only products you bought on the new site will show up here. And there we have it. That's a brief rundown of the most important features of the account area. Thanks so much for joining me for this video, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.